What's going on guys? Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to convert your 99 to 2004 Super Duty to have 2005 to 07 headlights. I'll explain the difference. So these are 05 to 07 headlights. If you order these headlights for, for your 05 to 07 truck, they'll fit. No problem. But if you're like me and you have a 99 to 2003 or 2004 rather, I messed up. 99 to 2004, um, somewhere around that time. It's pretty much like this. This is a 99 truck. This is a, a two piece headlights. You have the blinker and then you have this. It's two piece. And that's what this truck has, stock. And I'm gonna show you guys how to, how to go to the one piece headlights. Um, I cut this one out, I figured out what I was doing. So I'm gonna film it when I go to do this one. And I'm gonna show you guys how to cut it out just right. They come in this box right here, the foam. And you get two adapters for 90, it was like 90 something dollars. And they come from uh, Headlights Depot. Headlights Depot, right out of California. They, they got here fast, ordered them off Amazon. All right, so just get the old shitty headlight out. Uh, it wasn't too hard, it was hardly in there. Um, so yeah, so if you're new to this, on the bottom, there'll either, there'll either be uh, two Phillips heads or two bolts that are seven millimeter. So uh, pop that out. I use this tool right here. I like it. It's a Milwaukee. It's got an M12. Um, it's great. So it's great for little things. So get those out. You want to keep these clips for afterwards. And um, whatever bolts you take out there, you want to keep those. Oh, or screws. You want to keep those for sure. Because that's how I fasten. Like this light, I've already had it done. You can see. Um, there's one right there. I tighten back up. And then there's one there. And that's what secures the bottom of the light. So you definitely want that. You want to take all your wires back. Get them out of the way. Because you're going to be cutting. Um, right around through here. This is what you're gonna be cutting and I want to show you guys step by step. All right guys So you have a paint marker out and I marked up what you're gonna have to do um, That's it right there just cut in Run up. There's a little hole big hole little hole And then you want to watch and make sure you don't cut the whole bracket out though because like you see where it's bolted in at like here And here like you don't want to cut it's not hard to do really if you just use common sense and i i use this tool right here it's an old old school dewalt um just cutting wheel grinder whatever you want to call it and um i just held it steady stood up and just made my cuts and um right here you have to cut this off there's this little knob the old school two-piece headlights went in just went ahead and, and uh you just cut that off all right, guys, here I am. I want to show you guys how, how easy it is to cut this out. It takes like five, ten minutes.
you want to be careful when you get around here, you don't want to hit your fender. Get it all cut. It's not too terribly hard to get out. There you are. It is just a piece you need to cut out. Um, I accidentally cut this when I shouldn't have. But if you don't do that and you just cut that square out. Like I, like I did here. Uh, you'll be good. So uh, you really should just take your time. Yeah, water water hose helps keep keeps all the dust down. And clean up. I couldn't even see my my, my lines from my paint marker earlier. It was so it was so damn dusty. We don't have to spray that off. So now you have this, uh, you have this knot, this little nub right here with the grommet in it. You gotta cut that off, or your uh, your headlight, your O5 headlight won't sit flush against your fender. So you just uh, cut it off. Got dead battery. All right, guys. All right, good to go. Didn't hit my fender, no damage. The light should fit right in here. So, uh, I wanted to tell you guys about the grill. Um, I just had it sitting up there. But there's, uh, there's four clips on the top. And then there's uh, four clips on the bottom. I only have three, but it still holds it on there, so I don't really care. <clears throat> All right, guys. So um, I got it cut out. And I'm uh, going to install this headlight. should fit perfect. I had to trim a little extra on that side, just in some spots. But uh, let's see how it fits. I like to use this dielectric grease. Uh, on, on my connectors spray a little bit on there it's good to fight against corrosion and then if you ever have to take the uh, headlight apart it's pretty good for that too because they, they get seized up on there over time and that one don't even want to come off they're really easy to break too There we go. There's the old end of it. A little bit of grease in there. You don't have to have it, but I like using it. All right, before I uh, hook it up, I'm just gonna test for the fit. So get these wires out of the way. I like keeping the cover on there until the, the, the plastic cover over the headlight until the job's done. It's a smart thing to do. Alright. So I'm going to put my headlight in. Everything hooks up. Normal. 
So these headlights from Headlight Depot, uh, they came with the with two adapters, which are great. Um, they plug right up. Oh, wrong side. Plug right up. Alright, just like that. Let's tuck, tuck all the goodies back in here. Alright guys, so I had to trim a little bit off right here to get it to fit. Just kinda gotta play with it. Besides that, uh, it was cut out good. Uh, I got my two push pins on the top of the header. They're solid. Uh, it's really solid. But it's not going anywhere. So let me do some cleaning up here. I'll get it all put back together. I'm gonna lift my bumper back up and tighten the, tighten the bumper bolts down. Put the grill back on first. And uh, we'll see what she looks like. All right, guys. Here's the finished product. It looks rowdy as can be. Check that out. It's not hard to do. All you gotta do is order your headlights from Headlight Depot for $90 and uh cut your header out thanks for watching my video i really appreciate it and you guys uh you guys have a great day and we will see you next time later